Huskies man to man uh, under Mike Hopkins. Ever. That's a change this year. Yeah, he changed it this year just because of his personnel and felt like the toughness and the get after you mentality of these new players he has would work in man to man as McDaniels finished. That's good offense right there. And I've always said against the Mike Hopkins Washington zone, if you got a guy that can make that little 12 to 15 foot shot, you got a chance against that zone. But Daniel somehow was able to hold on to that and almost dunked it, pushed it through. Those are the shots that South Dakota is going to have to make if they're going to win the game. They've missed a few of them early, as I mentioned. And only down one, South Dakota. And up McDaniels. Hanging. What a finish. First bucket puts South Dakota in front by two. Well, Disclaimer, Aaron, I say it every time we do one of these games. The longer you leave these teams in the game, the more they think they can win as McDaniels knocks down. Again, another miss in there. That one was contested a little more difficult, but they've missed three or four in the paint that they'd like to have back. A tough shot, McDaniels. Oh, first half of those would go down. What a green. Not close, boy. Didn't draw iron. Never Reset the shot clock. McDaniels flying through the air. Third. Their lead score averaging 19 and 9 with four in the first half. Sorry, Aaron. Yes, Don? Yeah. McDaniels, he's having a phenomenal first half. He's got 15. The season it has not been great from the stripe 66 percent for the dogs. Yeah, that's gonna have to improve Seven game homestand here from Heckhead Continues on there's a big date with Gonzaga looming. Yeah, not far from now 72 after that, 50